हे दिस इज द सेकंड वीडियो ऑफ द सीरीज मॉड्युलर थर्ड पर्सन शूटर मास्टर क्लास इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू सेट अप द प्रोजेक्ट एंड ले द फाउंडेशन फॉर एवरीथिंग वी विल बिल्ड थ्रू आउट द सीरीज राइट नो आई एम यूजिंग अनरियल फाइव पॉइंट सिक्स टू स्टार्ट अ प्रोजेक्ट वी हैव टू ऑप्शन आई दर क्रिएट अ ब्लैंक प्रोजेक्ट और यूज दिस थर्ड पर्सन टेम्पलेट बट दिस डिफॉल्ट टेम्पलेट इज प्रीटी बेसिक इट ओनली कम्स विथ अ फ्यू एनिमेशंस विच इज नॉट आइडियल फॉर वट वी आर एमिंग टू बिल्ड दैट्स वाई आई हैव प्रिपेयर दिस कस्टम टेम्पलेट स्पेसिफिकली फॉर दिस सीरीज वेल यू कैन डाउनलोड दिस कस्टम टेम्पलेट कम्प्लीटली फ्री फ्रॉम माई पेट्रियन लिंक इज इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन दिस टेम्पलेट इंक्लूड्स ऑल द नेसेसरी हाई क्वालिटी एनिमेशन एंड सेटअप फर्स्ट लेट्स अंडरस्टैंड द प्रोजेक्ट स्ट्रक्चर इन साइड द कॉन्टेंट फोल्डर देर इज जस्ट वन मेन फोल्डर एवरीथिंग वी बिल्ड will go inside this folder only in this folder there are six sub folders all are very basics i am showing you one by one what's inside this folder in the mesh folder we have the default mannequin skeletal mesh physics assets and a skeleton the materials folder contains general purpose materials like the default mannequin materials and rest all the materials you are seeing here used to build the level in the maps folder there are a basic map i created just for this series everything you see here is just a few static meshes materials and some text nothing fancy inside the level prototyping folder we have all the meshes materials and textures used to build this level now only the blueprint and animation folder remain inside the animation folder you will find all the high quality animation assets and the setup animations are well organized based on locomotion states for example in the pistol folder we have all the animations related to pistol movement the same goes for other states like rifle shotgun and unarmed but all the animation magic happens in these two classes abp base and abp layer base if i open abp base you will see it has a lot of functions and variables the same applies to abp layer base as well it has also a lot of functions and variables this is a pretty advanced and modular animation setup let me show you how modular it is suppose you want to create a new locomotion state maybe like a sword state you just need to create a child class of abp layer base and rename it maybe uh, abp sword layer just like we have pistol rifle and unarmed layers now open this brand new child class in the details panel you will see all the placeholder animation slots that you have to fill you just need to attach your sword animations like sword idle animation all the sword turn animations sword start animations and so on and that's it now you have a fully working sword locomotion state just call it from the player character class whenever the player equips a sword very simple yet very powerful setup i will cover this advanced locomotion setup as well maybe in a separate series the main reason i am not covering it here is because it would take another 10 to 15 hours of tutorials next let's see the blueprint folder as you can see we have three classes here this is the player controller class it's blank nothing inside there you can create this from here next is the game mode class it's also blank i just bound the player controller class and the default pawn class now the last one is bp player the main player character class inside bp player i have just set up a few basic things like the spring arm and camera it's just a pretty basic setup now focus on these two functions these are responsible for switching the player's locomotion state and communicating with the animation blueprint because it's related to locomotion that's why i already created these functions for example if you want to switch from rifle to pistol locomotion state just call this function and select the desired state the other function is update gate settings this controls the gate like walking jogging or crouching 
That's it for the base template. We will build all the core mechanics on top of this setup. After every tutorial, I will upload the updated project files on my Patreon, including the full source code, PDFs, and even access to a private Discord server for you to discuss doubt. Join my Patreon, link is in the description. So that's the end of this video. In the next one, I will explain each and every option we have for enhanced input system.